But here's a bit of trivia for you. I was the first professor on Gilligan's Island. No, it's true. Look. Professor, can I help you? Gilligan, it is incorrect English to say, can I help you? You should say, may I help you? Professor, may I help you? No. <laughs> no. See, what happened was, we did the pilot uh, on the island of Kauai, and uh, when CBS saw the finished product, they decided I was too young to play the professor, and I was replaced. I mean, no big deal. I got over it. What, uh, it took six months, a year. You know. <laughs> but every now and then, it's curious, even now, when I see a particularly poignant episode of Gilligan's Island, <laughs> a little tear will form in the corner of my eye. And I'll think to myself, what if one desolate crew, lost and vegetarian, the house, Ginger and Marianne, this nearly was mine. I felt like a star. Bob Denver was by my side. Jim Backus would give me five. This nearly was mine. Well, I thought I did so well. They told me I was swell. Then came that call from hell that said, it's over. I was unemployed. thrill again to be next to Gilligan this nearly was mine there was a boy a very strange Enchanted boy. They say he traveled very far, very far over land and sea. The wisest thing you'll ever learn is just to love and be loved in return. That's Melissa. How I've lived till now. I tell them I don't Her eyes get gray and cloudy, then the rain begins to fall. Pitter patter, pitter patter, love is gone, so what can matter? No sweet love a man comes to
the joy it brings. Here's to life, to dreamers. be weathered and all that's good get better here's to life here's to love and here's to you